Hiya, sorry I heard a noise and I stopped the video and then I had to stop it again because I kept hearing the noise again, it's like a tapping. So I just wanted to make, you know, see what it is, but I don't know what it is. <laughs> okay, so um, the next one I'm going to clarify is the death card, which is um, change and transformation, um, something breaking down to create the new, if that makes sense. So you've got temperance, which is um, balance um, and patience. So with this death and destruction and real truth, which is change and transformation, you're learning patience and having a healthy balance in your life rather than focusing on one thing. And then you've also got the Knight of Swords that come out. Um, I'm still going to shuffle as well. The Knight of Swords that come out and that is an offer. So maybe from this change and transformation, you want to go and offer someone truth and clarity or it's this offer that came in caused um, an ending um, and it's teaching you now patience and balance to have a healthy balance um but i just want to see what else is for it so some kind of offer is either coming in which is courage and action and um best of intentions maybe that's caused this um uh ending as well this um you know taking actions and best intentions um but truth and clarity as well i think that's it for that so i'm not going to take anything else um, so we'll see what else is next. So the fox, which is the knight of wands, which is um, an offer of passion. Um, so you've got offer of truth and you've got offer of passion too, whether this is a situation or a person as well. Um, and it's taking the leadership role and um, going for your passion. So you might be getting an offer as well, or you might be wanting to offer one for four just turned up. Anything else for the knight of wands? No, I have ones, anything for the night of ones. I like this one that's come out. So Ace of Swords, yeah, it's clarifying uh, this um, truth and clarity might come towards you through this night of ones. Um, maybe you're only going to get some kind of truth and clarity from this offer. Um, conquest, clear vision and discernment. That's a gift from the universe as well. That's why there's a hawk on there, very spiritual. Um, anything else for the night of ones? <clears throat> Dolphin. Knight of Cups. Yeah, maybe you're going to get an offer of love and passion coming towards you and it's divinely guided. Um, and it's going to give you some kind of truth and clarity. Um, for sure. So, and stepping into leadership role too. So sometimes someone's taking the lead with this offer. Um, the Five of Pentacles. That's um, feeling left out in the cold. Block communication. Maybe someone's manifested this block communication, loneliness, loss of home, dark night of the soul, or someone's facing dark night of the soul and they're trying to manifest willpower, alchemy. Um, let's see, or they manifested that by accident because they were focused on it too much. Uh, five of swords. Um, yeah, so the five of swords is um, uh, conflict, disagreements, 313 just turned up conflict disagreements um arguments things that are you know conflicts basically and maybe it's caused this um feeling left out in the cold and new communication possibly blocking um but you're trying to manifest a message coming towards you that's a passionate message enthusiasm free spirit and new ideas or maybe you'll get a message of you know that's going to make you feel enthusiastic and new ideas coming towards you maybe that's what you're trying to manifest um but someone's definitely feeling left out in the cold or you've left someone else feeling out in the cold. Could be to do with that ending. Um, but you're going to be signing some kind of contract. Um, or maybe it's a, a contract that, that has ended, you know, and that you feel left out in the cold from. And, that, you know, um, maybe it's an ending of like a marriage, a relationship, something like that. And that's why you're feeling left out in the cold and five of swords, which is conflict, arguments, disagreements. Um, but try and manifest um, this message coming towards you because it's going to create, um, you know, you'll be more of a free spirit, you'll be more enthusiastic and you'll get new ideas coming towards you. Um, I'll just see if there's anything else for the collective. Anything else for the collective. Ooh, I'm going to take both of them. Ah, oh, again, yeah, some kind of clarity from the divine. So you're going to get some kind of truth, clarity, wisdom coming towards you. Clear vision, discernment. And um, the Eight of Swords is uh, 444, uh, self-imposed prism. Maybe you're feeling like you're in a self-imposed prism from this Five of Pentacles, which is feeling left out in the cold, but you're going to get some kind of clear vision. Or maybe this clear vision has left you feeling a little bit trapped. Um, so 
something to do with feeling trapped and an ending and feeling left out in the cold. But you are going to get your wishes and dreams coming towards you and a message of some kind too, possibly third party. But something's really slow as well, slow moving, and there's been some kind of ending as well. So I hope that's helped or given you clarity. You could have truth and clarity from this um, thingy. I'm just going to shuffle one more of these, see if there's anything else that Archangel's going to say. Anything else for that reading? Oh, and I want to do the truth, hidden truth as well. Oh, this is flipped over. I wish things could have been different. Wow. Okay, anything else in your angels? So angel, Archangel Haniel, seek soul satisfaction, fan of flame and inner happiness. Oh, and also there was um, soulmate and twin flame in that reading as well, wasn't there? Like a divine counterpart. Okay, so let's just do some hidden truth and then that'll be it. What is here from, what does someone want to say to the collective? What messages are here for the collective? <clears throat> Okay, so you came closer than anyone, 616. Um, I wish I could take back my words. Maybe they said the wrong thing. Anything else for the collective? My life is not as together as it seems. So maybe they made out they were more together than they are. Which is fine, because everyone goes through that. I'm starting to understand our connection a little bit more. Maybe they've had some kind of clarity from someone. Um, and one more is I hide behind material things, which is never good. And again, I'm starting to understand our connection is on the back. So that's it for today. Hope it's helped. Bye.